Hi, in this video I'll show you how to use app for converting TSV files into um, SQL scripts and uh, for, into SQL scripts for different database for MySQL, um, SQL Server or SQLite. Um, I can show you on my local computer I have a state TSV. It's a TSV file and I have a TSV viewer installed I have a link on this app too. Um, it can show what is inside of TSV files and we can see there is like a list of states from Alabama to Wyoming and I can also export these states into different format as well right, right away. Um, so uh, I will convert uh, this states TSV into SQL script uh, with app from a website this is my website, I will link on the site in the description. To, to find the app, I will click on search and type TSV and click on TSV converter. Click on TSV into SQL and click on download to start downloading process. I will be recording more videos on TSV format and uh, converting apps. If you are interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. Uh, you can see archive has been downloaded. I'll click on downloaded archive, double click on MSI to start installation, click on more info here and click, uh, I'm getting the screen from uh, Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft. You can see publisher unknown. I'll just click run anyway button and uh, to start installation, click on next, next install, click on yes and click on finish on final screen. And you can see um, uh, app has been sold to my computer. I have a new shortcut on my desktop. Let's close this and this. And double click on shortcut to launch app. Now conversion is three steps process. I can close this as well. Um, conversion is three steps process. In first step I have to select a TSV file. I'll click on this button, navigate to uh, my state TSV. Click on it to select it. I can also select multiple files if I hold shift and uh, I can select group of files or I can uh, click on and uh, hold Ctrl and press A to select all files um, and all files will be added. But uh, for demonstration purposes, I will convert just um, one single file. I'll just click on open, click on next step. Here, if um, I have to specify conversion options, I can leave, uh, so for um, if my TC file contains, um, first row of my TC file contains column names, I will leave this check. If I want to add ID field, I will leave this checked as well. Basically, ID field is a unique identifier for a record in the SQL database, and um, it's nice to have a field, so I will leave it as it is. And I will have to select, select a database type. For this, I will select SQL Server. Click on next and here on file screen, I can preview my SQL script. You can see it creates table states and it's inserted into table all data. And um, finally, I can serve that all to my SQL file. It's asking for name and location. This name and location is okay. I'll just click save and file has been saved. Let's go and see file. I can open it with notepad just to show you what is inside. Um, yeah, we have to create table instruction and we have insert data as well. So now I can send this, um, I can send this, uh, SQL, uh, script to my DBA and he will run it or I can run it on my, um, against my database and have all this data from TSV file installed, uh, inserted into my table. Uh, basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in comments. Thank you.